I was not interested in creating Instagram Reels. You know, videos and so don't last a long time on Instagram. When I started to create them, I thought I was wasting my time. In this video, I will show you how I use Canva, yes, Canva, to create simple, beautiful Instagram Reels in less than five minutes. Yes, <laughs> less than five minutes, right? And I will show you how I create my Instagram Reels in Canva step by step. So we'll create something looking like this right here in less than five minutes. So also I do have a bonus tip on how you can create passive income with Instagram Reels. I would also like to share how you can um, repurpose your Instagram Reels so that you're not wasting your time when you actually create them. We all know that Instagram Reels are only 15 to 30 seconds video. And uh, most of us, well, for, at first when I started, I was like, why do I create Instagram Reels? You know, this short little video that basically will last no time uh, um, in Instagram, right? I was not interested in creating Instagram Reels because, you know, videos and so don't last a long time on Instagram. And I basically, when I started to create them, I thought I was wasting my time. Yes. But with Canva, it has made that so much easier. It has taken out, it has cut my work in half to create very attractive Instagram reels just by using Canva. And I will show you this right now so stay tuned okay so we are in canva and we'll just type in instagram reels video and canva gonna help us um bring up the what we're looking for options so you can simply choose from there and we'll choose instagram reels video and click on that so from here of course we will be faced with so many options that hmm, you know it, it's kind of hard to choose from all the, the the large variety that Canva shows us. Okay, so we can just click on fashion because I'm the fashion niche. So I will be doing something on fashion. I will just select some uh, template that I like, but just for the purpose of the video, I think I will work with this one, this one. <laughs> See, they all are beautiful and it's really hard to choose, okay? But I like this, so let's choose this one. All right, let me upload my videos. So what we're looking at here is a video that is, you know, I guess a stock video from Canva, okay? And it is 15.2 seconds long, so let's just play it. Okay, so it has one, two, three, four, five slides on the time, its timeline. Okay, so what we'll do is sort of replace the slides that's there and, you know, sort of make it our own. Um, we can start from scratch, but if you really want to save time, this is what you have to do. I'll click on the first slide and delete the video. All right. So now that the video has deleted, I will go into my folders and I will select a video that I've created. Right, of course, I will mute the audio and upload this video. Okay, so now I will double click on this and delete the video here and upload the other video. I want this to be as large as possible so persons can actually see the beauty of the item. So I'll zoom in as much as I can. All right, so these are my videos. I can actually add more items here so I can combine that with photos and simply animate the photos. So since I don't have any more uh, videos, what I will do is use photos, okay? 
this is looking lovely already. So you double click, delete, and choose another picture. Do I have videos? Yeah, I have video. Oh, this is looking cool already. Right. So this is already looking really good, but we will have to cut down on the length of this video right actually i would like to start off with this video so what i can what i will simply do is click on this and drag it to the front yeah drag it to the front <laughs> okay i know i have some changes to do but i'll also click on this one and drag it to the, the front of this as well all right so i like the text here but this is an image so what we'll do is just simply remove this and we can use this again you can cut it and place it over here okay let's see what's in this one lead back for da 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 okay we will what we will do is reposition this right it's looking hot already okay so we'll have to reposition this all right okay we might even change this later on but let's let us continue okay all right so let us look for some text that we can easily insert here and the video is still a bit long but what we'll do is just cut down on yeah so we'll cut it down a bit by clicking on the edge of the slide here and drag it in okay because remember facebook uh instagram says 15 seconds video 15 seconds so let us keep it to 15 seconds shall we oh okay so i think this will work on our video let's go elements Okay, so this is where the, the paper came from. So we'll use this and we can use this as well. Okay, I like that. Then what we'll do next is insert a text. Um, let's keep it simple for the purpose of this video. Cute earrings. And we will change the font to something a little more... A little a little more attractive or catchy you know but we want to ensure that the font is uh, clear enough so that persons will be able to read it so cute earrings um let us duplicate this and we're gonna put must haves and now we have the must haves here and we will bowl this okay and all this we can animate it all right so what we'll do is just double click on this and we can put um hmm, laid back for what do they have my me time okay so we can put simple for work simple enough I'll just put simple <laughs> simple for work okay and then you go to the next slide and what I'll do is simply copy this and paste this in here I need the background Okay, and position backwards. Let's put simple for a date. All right. Let's look at this one. Okay, you're gonna leave this here, and over here, 
um what we can put is business casual for work and brunch uh we can leave that as well right but remember when you are creating this you will take your time and fix it up anyhow you like okay and of course if you have your logo you can insert your logo here inside this as well i also need to animate some things so i'll animate this okay i like that um let's go back to the photo and let's go to photo movement right i like that so this is how we're going to be animating this is how we will be this is animation we will choose for the photo we're going to click on photo zoom and i think well i really like the, the effect of that okay so next what we'll do is look for audio so we finally found audio right it is inside elements and you click on i guess you search for whatever audio you would like to use um so i like the pop music okay guys so for demonstration purposes we will just stick with what we have at the moment um so what we'll do is simply in order to download this before you upload as a reel you can well everything is in place you know simple and easy you click on download as an mp4 okay so you download as an mp4 click on download and then you just let it download so i hope this video was very informative and if you guys enjoyed it please like and subscribe to this video you know i'm small and i'm trying to grow so i'm really you know depending on you guys to help me grow by subscribing to my channel okay so now for the bonus tip right so when you create instagram reels and you become you've become a pro in creating instagram reels you can also create instagram reels templates and sell on places like etsy and creative market and make s and make passive income doing so all right so you know so if you want to make some extra money on the side this is what you can do you know there are many persons selling instagram real templates on etsy making a ton of money right also in, on creative market you can place your templates on creative market as well and make some money so if you enjoy creating reels you can probably you know take the extra step and make some money creating instagram reels and placing it on marketplaces such as etsy and creative market also you can even place your instagram reel templates for sale on your own websites if you have one okay bonus tip two how i repurpose my instagram reels guys as i said i really don't want to waste time making content and having to throw it away you know so what i do is create my um instagram reels and repurpose it for pinterest and also instagram stories as well you can also use instagram reels for tiktok if you want okay so this is how i repurpose my instagram reels also if the instagram reel is pertaining to a certain product or you know if it's pertaining to a certain product or something uh, evergreen item that i can you know that i may use again in the future i will save that instagram reel and reuse it again at a later date all right so this is how i save time and energy by creating you know one instagram reel that i can use for several other platforms and hopefully some other time in the future okay so guys this is my bonus tip for you and i really hope that you enjoy the video and again if you do subscribe i'm a small channel growing okay also i would like to thank you for watching this video and wish you all the best on your business journey bye bye